YouTube, Farmer Son Prepping here. So, I thought we would do a recorded video today. Uh, I've got my Wallaby uh, bags opened up here. These are the seven and a half mil. These are the MRE bags. These have the gusseted bottom on it. They have the zipper and the tearaway portion that I'll be sealing tomorrow. And I say tomorrow because I've got a little bag sealer coming with my Amazon order. It will be here tomorrow. But I can go ahead and put these in here and zip up the Ziploc portion. Press all the air out, of course. Uh, zip up the Ziploc portion and then put my oxygen absorbers in. Uh, probably won't do the oxygen absorber part tomorrow when I get the, the sealer. That way I can do it all at one time. But I'm going to go ahead and get these... Uh, in here I've got uh, what I picked up this month to put up with some uh, some 15 bean soup we got one pound four ounces of that we got a pound of uh, great northern beans and we got four pounds of rice two two pound bags of uh, white long grain rice enriched rice so I'm going to go ahead and start with the 15 bean soup first. I, I chose the MRE bags because they look like they'll hold a little bit more. Uh, they're a little uh, little fatter, maybe. We'll see. Uh, see if I can get this whole bag in this one uh, envelope here, but maybe not. All right, so let's use your Swiss Army knife. I'm in here instead of at the kitchen table because I have air in here and it is hot y'all I already have my labels Wallaby gives you pre-made labels I've already got my labels made out I don't know if you can see that they're handwritten I may have to go back over them in Sharpie alright here we go hope y'all are all having a good day today uh, it's a hot one here. Yes. May not have made the hole big enough. Come on. Oh, there's my seasoning pack. That's what stopped it up. Okay. Now, let's go again. may be too much let's see yeah that's gonna be too much for one envelope so I've got another one right here we can take and dump some of those out sometimes you just don't know until you try it y'all maybe I can do this without making a mess Push out any air. Zip that on up. All right. According to this little label that they send you, Wallaby Goods, uh, dry beans in these bags will last approximately 25 years. So that's pretty good. These are thick, seven and a half mil on each side. So uh, plenty of protection. Go ahead and put a label on this bad boy so I don't forget what's in there. So I was watching Tomcat's World, and apparently, my channel made channel of the day today. Thank you, Tomcat. I appreciate that. Uh, I've been watching some prepper channels. Uh, thought maybe today I would do a prepper of the day. Today's prepper of the day is my old buddy Jim up there in East Tennessee preparedness. 
I'm not wearing my hat today because my hair is soaking wet with sweat and I'm trying to get it to dry out. Uh, so, uh, Jim, East Tennessee Preparedness, he's always doing the things. Uh, he's stocking food today. So, um, I'm stocking food today, so I feel like we're on a similar wavelengths. He's doing what he can to protect his children and, and everything else. So, uh, that's my prepper of the day. Jim, East Tennessee Preparedness. Shout out to you, Jim. All right. Again, I'll seal all these bags tomorrow when my little bag sealer comes in. I had borrowed my sister's flat iron, but she took it back. Apparently, she had to do somebody's hair for somebody's wedding or something. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> anyway, I need one of my own, so it's not that big a deal. We ordered this one. This one here is 15 bean soup as well. Press all the air out. I know y'all all know how to do this. Y'all are all probably doing all this about as often as I am. But I just figured I would uh, make a video today. This is 15 bean soup. As well. Give me my little label here. It is a typical hot July Alabama day, y'all. I took the dogs down to the lake. They found something dead again and rolled in it. So uh, I took them to the lake hoping they could wash some of that mess off because it's stuck to high heaven. Uh, <laughs> so they're outside because they stink. Both of them do. I don't know. They keep trying to top the last dead stinky thing they found. Trust me, this one's way worse than the last time, or at least it seemed like it is. All right, there's that one. Got to the bag. I opened these up and kind of fluffed them out because it takes time to. They're all packed real flat when you get them. This time we're going to go great northern beans here. Great Northern. Maybe that's a big enough hole. Here we go. Obviously not a big enough hole. I try to keep my hole small because I end up making a mess all over my table. Here we go. to fit in here perfectly. Now the 15 bean soup was a pound and a quarter. That's why it was too much. So that's going to fit perfectly. Sip that up. Anyhow y'all, uh, hope you're having a good week. Uh, whatever you do, hydrate. Keep yourself uh, from being dehydrated. One of those uh, liquid IVs ain't a bad idea, you know, once or twice a week. Uh, take care of yourselves. Do the things. Stack it. This is FSP. We'll check y'all later.